All right, we're out here at 11826 Mango. Nice curb appeal here. Quick look at the neighborhood. Looks like they're renovating the house across the street. Alright, well, we'll go ahead and head in. You got the two car gar garage out here. Sorry, I got the hiccups. I think they really did a nice job with the landscaping, nice and trimmed. <clears throat> Walking in, you've got this nice um, vinyl flooring here. Um, newer paint looks like as well. Uh, we've got we've got seven foot, seven and a half, maybe or eight foot ceilings probably here. Um, so a little bit of the layout of this house. You're gonna have the uh, master bed back there, kitchen, uh, family room. You're gonna have a one bathroom back here, two beds, um, and then yeah, master uh, has a master suite as well here. So let me take out the angle here so we can see a little bit better. I hope that's a little bit better. Um, it does make the room sizes look a little bit bigger though, so just keep that into consideration that they're probably a little bit smaller than they look on the video. So walking through, here's our kitchen. We've got, uh, you know, older appliances in here, uh, old white whirlpools there, but they look to be nice and clean, like they took care of them pretty well. Kind of a quick, quick look at the backyard. You're kind of right against these guys, but you could always put up a privacy fence like that one there, um, which is, I, I would recommend. It'd be pretty cheap too, because you're just, you're just doing from there to there. As you can see there, they already have a privacy fence on that side and one on that side. So you only have this little bit of strip to do here. So let's take a look at the master bed. Um, that is a, I believe that is a uh, queen size bed. Yeah, I believe that's a queen size bed there. Um, so it fits pretty good. It's in here pretty good. And they've got this big dresser, um, walk-in closet over here course full of stuff here um, sellers are in the middle of moving out so here's your bathroom there's me <laughs> and um, yeah this is a tub shower combo you just have the one vanity here they didn't update the countertops or anything but I do love this vinyl floor that they went with throughout here um, you just have the uh, carpet in the bedrooms so yeah, let's, uh, we'll walk out, you know, a little bit of cabinetry up there as well. Um, a lot of counter space in this kitchen. You got this nice little bar area where they got the fish tank. Two windows in here for some natural light. Yep, and then here's your um, second bathroom. Single vanity, tub shower, and here's your First spare bedroom. These are good size. You could fit a full in here pretty comfortably. I think anything bigger than that will make it pretty tight. Um, yeah, these are probably uh, probably about 13 by 12. 13 by 12, maybe 14 foot bedrooms. Yep, and here's your um, AC. Gonna see if they've got a quick date on it real quick. Kind of give you guys an idea of when it was last serviced, but uh, yeah, not seeing it on this unit. <clears throat> okay, yeah, well, we can ask about that. So let's see, we got another coat closet back here before you get to the, um, before you get to the garage. And here's your two-car garage. Um, like I said, they're still in the middle of moving out. You got a little side door there to kind of go around the side. Um, and you got a little bit of clearance on each side of the garages here. It's a little bit wider than your standard. Um, yeah, nice garage in here, though. <clears throat> I 
<clears throat> so yeah, this long hallway. And then, uh, yeah, I think I forgot to show you guys this. Here is your washer and dryer, which is nice that it's in the house rather than in the hot garage during the summer. And missing a couple smoke detectors here. Uh, an inspector would definitely have a problem with that, so we'd have to ask them to put some new ones in. Um, let's take a quick look at that backyard while we're here. Yeah, and then, uh, so yeah, little side yard here. You can probably close that off. I'm not sure if the HOA has a rule about that or anything. Um, so yeah, walking around the other side. Big trees back here, a lot of shade. Not much grass can grow with all this tree coverage here. And I don't think enough sunlight gets back here. Uh, but yeah, cute little backyard here. Not, not much to have to maintain. And that is it. So let's uh, take a quick look back through the front door here. We'll head back out. Let me shut this bathroom light off. And the hallway light. All right, so we'll head back out now. back out yeah we got a nice sunset today and I get another quick look at the outside and that is it give me, me a call and let me know what you think nope oh, you're good right there <laughs> sorry about that the sellers just pulled up no problem